This is a video from eSkills Zone. For more videos, notes, and certificates, please visit www.eSkillsZone.com. Hello and welcome. Hi, viewers. Today in this video, we will discuss module 36 of chapter graphics in GW basic programming language. And the program we're going to learn today is to draw a star using basic graphics. So let's switch to the IDE of GW basic programming language viewers. So in line 10, we will type CLS line 20 we'll type screen 2 line 30 line statement is used with coordinate 30 comma 140 minus 320 comma 70 line 40 we will type line minus 250 comma 140 line 50 we will type line minus 395 comma 95 line 60 line minus 230 comma 95 line 70 once again line statement with minus 360 comma 140 now we press the F4 key and give it name of program as star dot BAS and press the F2 key So here is the code of the program and when we press the F2 key so you can see a star on the screen. So viewers now we will do the interpretation. So here is in line 10. See this command is used to clear the contents of the screen line 20 screen 2 statement is used so that we can draw star in high resolution mode in line 30 line statement is used and the values are 360, 140 and 310, 60. The values of x1 coordinate is 360 and y1 coordinate is 140 whereas the values For x2 coordinate is 310 and y2 coordinate is 60 in line 40 line minus 250 comma 140 is used so you can see that there are no x1, y1 coordinates are used here as values are given for x2, y2 coordinates. The 
the values are given for s2 coordinate as 250 and y2 coordinate as 140 in line 50 line minus 395,95 is used. So you can see that I'm going to copy this line. There are no x1 y coordinates are used, where values are given for x2 coordinate as 395 and y2 coordinate as 95. In line sixty line minus two thirty ninety five is used so you can see there there are no x one y one coordinates are used whereas values are given for x two coordinate as two thirty and y two coordinate as 95 and line 70 line minus 360 comma 140 is used so you can see there are no x1 coordinates are used whereas values are given for x2 coordinate as 360 and y2 coordinate as 140 so eventually after executing the above code you will see a star on the screen okay now the next program viewers we're going to discuss today in our video is is a program to draw a concentric circle of different radii on the screen so let's switch to the IDE so in line 10 we will type CLS line 20 we will type screen 2 line 30 for r equal to 2 to 100 step 20 line 40 circle statement is used circle 250 comma 90 comma r as a radius line 50 next statement is used now we will give name as cocentric dot bs name of the program press the f2 key so you can see so here is the program viewers of curl five lines and when we execute it by pressing the f2 key so you can see concentric circle of different radii on the screen so let's discuss this program in the text area so you see, now you can see a program on the screen of five lines with the help of which we can see five circles concentric circles on the screen of different radii so let's interpret this program In line 10, CLS command is used to clear the contents of the screen. In line 20, screen 2 statement is used, which will 
display the output using the higher resolution graphics mode line 30 for loop is used with initial with numeric variable named R with initial having initial values as 2 and final value as 100 with an increment of 20 in line 40 circle statement is used with x coordinate 250 and y coordinate as 90 and r is used as a radius so we'll call it r is used as radii because we have used for loop and the starting value is 20 to 100 so it means that the loop will be executed to there is a difference 20 so you can see 20 and then 40 and then 60 and 80 and then 100 so you can see five cells on the screen one two three four and five line 50 next statement is used to terminate for loop execution since the initial value is 20 and final value is 100 and the increment used with step keyword is 20 so the sequence of loop execution of different area is as follows the first loop is displayed with the radius 20 and then the second okay this first circle is displayed and the second circle is displayed with the radius 40 third circle is displayed with the radius 60 and then fourth circle is displayed with the radius 80 and fifth circle is displayed with the radius 100 so this is how you can see five different circles of five different radii on the screen which is called concentric circle that's all viewers thanks for watching